the arrest of three, including one 21-year youth, Imam Hossein, from Shonaimuri Upozila, in connection to looting arms, torching Shonaimuri police station, and murdering a cop sparked a denial drama from the student coordinators on involvement of the arrestees with student protest. Analysts say, the denial drama is waged to conceal the involvement of supporters of coordinators in violent activists like murdering cops and looting arms under the cover of anti-discrimination movement. According to mother of Imam and those took part in protest in the locality, Imam was actively involved in the protest. According to media reports, on August 5th, attack including vandalism and arson took place in Shonaimuri police station. During the attack, Mohammed Ibrahim, a police constable, was murdered. On August 15th, a case was filed with the police station. Based on the charge, Imon was arrested. According to rights activists, the arrest brought to light the involvement of active followers and supporters of student coordinators in the horrific attacks on police stations and looting of armories. But in an immediate denial drama, student coordinators went into an overdrive to claim one of the attacker was not aligned with their protest. Even one coordinator branded the attacker as member of criminal gang, but Emran can be seen in a photo, circulated on social media, holding a firearm looted from police station following attack. Let's take a look at efforts to disown affiliation with police station attackers. Serge's alarm one of the key coordinators very quickly not only disowned the arrested but also ruled out outright the involvement of the three in the protest. According to Prothom Alo, in a Facebook post, Sergis Alam claimed none of the three arrested in connection to killing of cop did not even take part in the protest regularly. Rather, they are member of local teen-based crime gangs. Similarly, Asif Mahmoud, a coordinator's turned advisor, echoed a similar drama and even went ahead to claim the arrestees were involved with mugging. Like Sirgis, Asif also did not offer a single shred of proof in defense of evidence. In a Facebook post, Asif claimed none of the arrestees were involved with our protest. Rather, they were even involved with crimes like mugging. But media reports based on accounts of locals and the mother of one of the arrestees laid bare the opposite to the denial drama of coordinators. According to family members and locals, Imam Hossein has been actively involved and took streets at the call of students' coordinators. My son actively participated during the protest, overthrow Awami League, liberated the country, mother of Imam. In the entire move, Imam was very much involved with us. On August 5th, we were on the streets. At one stage, police opened fire, but we can say he was with protest, but not involved with us. According to media reports, over 450 police stations were attacked and armories looted, while rights activists say over hundreds of cops were murdered between July and August in solidarity with call by student coordinators and supporters of Dr. Yunus.